Holy Spirit, come, transform me. Beloved, you are accepted into my family. You are my child. I've received you. Receive others. You are sanctified in me. Not only that, but you've been set free in me. Jesus Christ, stand firm then and do not be subject again to the yoke of slavery. The enemy comes to steal, kill and destroy with his lies. I've come that you may have life and have it in abundance. Commune with me. Take communion often. Remember. Remember what I did for you at the cross. Remember why I went to the cross. To set you free. Beloved, in me you are free. Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. The Spirit of God lives in you. And the same Spirit that rose me from the grave, the Spirit of God lives in you is the same Spirit that rose me from the grave. of your sins you have been brought near by my blood and now you are a member of my body and a partaker in the promise you can have boldness and confidence and access to my father because of my faithfulness and your faith in me Put on the new, which has been created in my Father's image. Put on the new man, which has been created in my Father's image. In righteousness and holiness that comes from truth. For you were once darkness, but now you are light.
as children of light. Let the peace of God, my Father, guard your heart and mind. As he will supply your every need according to his glorious riches in me. Beloved, you are complete in me. I am the head over every ruler and authority. Beloved, as you're also raised up with me, keep seeking the things above where I am, seated at the right hand of God. For you died and your life is hidden with me, God. Let me be the center of your life, the foundation of your life, the cornerstone, your rock. I'll never fail you, nor forsake you, nor abandon you. Your heart to me is the most precious thing in the world. That is why I came to reveal the Father's heart to you and to die for your sin so we could live in freedom, free from bondage and alive in love. This is why the angels sing, you are worthy our Lord and God to receive glory and honor and power for you created all things and by your will they were created and have their being. 